Hey guys, I decided I wanted to share with you my upper body training today and explain what I'm doing. My A series is what's known as a mechanical advantage drop set, where in this case I am using three exercises. The idea is that every proceeding exercise places you in a position where you are stronger. So you begin with a weaker position and gradually progress to positions that are naturally stronger as you fatigue from exercise to exercise. A1 was a seated, unsupported behind the neck press. Uh, unsupported because my back, as you see, has no uh, support. I love behind the neck presses for the complete delt work they offer. It's not only the front delts that are working, but the side and rear deltoids. Definitely not an exercise for everyone, as many people would be lacking the shoulder mobility required. My next exercise, my A2, was an incline pin touch press. I stopped the pins at just below the middle portion of the range of motion. This is where I feel my chest work the hardest. The goal here is not to wait too long between reps. Touch, maybe half to one second maximum pause and then lift. These are great for developing the, the chest. My next exercise, as you'll see very soon, is a flat dumbbell press. Now, in this case, I'm not actually doing any reps. So you're gonna see in one second. So here we go. Now, the goal with this is to completely fatigue the muscle fibers of my chest. So notice that, like I said, I'm not doing any reps. I'm holding the weight for as long as I can until I feel that I cannot withstand it anymore. This is known as a yielding isometric. The benefit with isometrics is that they don't wear you out as much as actual reps. So basically they aren't very costly in terms of which exercise or which method you should be using. They are easier to recover from, which is a huge bonus. Seeing as I am doing three exercises with relatively high volume, I performed only three sets for my A series. Anyway, I wouldn't have been able to perform the fourth set without severely dropping the weight, which would have likely led to junk reps anyway, which I uh, like to stay away from. Remember, you have to keep yourself focused and dialed in during your training. As soon as your focus drops, you know your quality will suffer, and that's when chances uh, for injury increase. And if nothing else, stress hormone is ramped up for nothing, only taking away your body's ability to recover properly. Now, I also filmed my B and C series, so if you guys are interested in seeing that, just let me know, uh, you know, write a comment, say you want to see it, and uh, I'll make another post. Thanks for watching.